ready? It's sing-along time. J-E-S-U-S means that God's the best. Yes, he shows us God is love. God is love. J-E-S-U-S means that God's the best. Yes, he shows us God is love. God is love. Jesus came for everyone. Amazing grace, God sent his son. Well, hallelujah. here and I am so excited to be here with you today. Do you remember what our big idea is for this month? Jesus grew up with family and friends. So we've spoken about Jesus' parents. We've spoken about Jesus' cousin, John the Baptist. Today, we're gonna talk about Jesus going to a party with his friends and mother. Oh, this is gonna be so much fun. I love going to parties. I love dressing up. Isn't this a cute dress? I just love all the pretty colors and the fancy scarves. And I love the shoes. Oh, these are so pretty. Let's put them on. Oh, look how they spin. Sparkle! These are really fun party shoes. How do I look? Ah, oh, and I love the food! Chocolate cake is my favorite! And cupcakes! Do you guys love cupcakes? Mmm, yummy! All right, I feel like dancing. What's a party without dancing? I love the dancing. Do you guys love to dance too? Dance party! Okay, so enough of this. I wanna hear all about Jesus' party. Let's go to story time. Story time! Oh, hi friends. It's good to see you again. This story I'm gonna share with you is about Jesus' very first miracle he turns water into wine. Let's read. Jesus and his friends were at a wedding. It was a really great party, and Jesus' mom, Mary, was there too. At special parties like weddings, the person who is throwing the party always makes sure that their guests have all of the best things, like good food and good drinks. But at this wedding, the wine ran out. Mary found out and she told Jesus. She knew Jesus could do something to help. At first, Jesus said, this isn't our problem. But Mary insisted and Jesus obeyed his mom. Mary told the servants to listen to whatever Jesus said to do. He told them to fill these six really, really big jars with water. Once they were filled, he said, okay, Take some out and give it to the man in charge to drink. So the servants did what Jesus told them to. When the man in charge tasted it, he went over to the person who was throwing the party and said, this is the very best wine. Jesus had turned the water into wine. Isn't that amazing? That was Jesus' very first miracle. Not just anybody could do that, but Jesus is God's son, and so he could. What a cool story. Could you imagine how fun it would be to be at a party with Jesus? I love that thought. Anyway, it's time for you to go and have some fun together now. Activity time. 
Wasn't that such a great story? While we think about how amazing Jesus is and how wonderful his miracles are, we can also remember the big idea. Do you remember what the big idea is? Don't worry if you don't remember. Our big idea is Jesus grew up with family and friends. Okay, so let's come up with some actions so that we can remember it. What should we do for Jesus? I know, let's do sign language. So if you get your middle finger here and your middle finger here and you touch your palms, that's Jesus. Got it? Okay, how about grew up? I know, get down really small. Come on with me, get down on the floor. Make yourself really, really small. And then get big like a tree. Grew up, perfect. Now, family and friends. How about we put one arm over our family and the other arm over friends. Group hug, yay! Got it? Okay, so, Jesus. Grew up with family and friends. Group hug, yay! Let's do it again. Got it? Jesus. Grew up with family and friends. Yay! Group hug. Awesome job. And we can remember that even though Jesus is God's son, he grew up with family and friends too. Key verse. Hey friends. Hey. Are you ready to learn today's key verse? Then let's get up and put some moves to it. Before we add the movements, say it with me. This is my son and I love him. I am very pleased with him. Listen to him. Matthew 17 verse five. Awesome, now let's put some moves to it. This is my son. Two steps to one side. And I love him. Two steps the other. I'm very pleased with him. Jump up and down three times. Listen to him. Put your hand to your ear. Matthew 17, verse five. Open your hands like you're reading the Bible. Now let's put it all together. This is my son. Two steps to one side. And I love him. Two steps to the other. I'm very pleased with him. Jump up and down three times. Listen to him. Put your hand to your ear. Matthew 17, verse five. Open your hands like you're reading the Bible. That was wonderful. Did you know that God calls you his child too? Yeah, he loves you and he is very pleased with you. Now go tell an adult, Jesus loves me and you. Awesome job guys, bye. Bye. Prayer time. It's almost time to say goodbye, but before we do, may I pray with you? How about today, let's put our hands out like we're holding hands with our friends and family as we pray. You ready? Let's pray. Dear Lord, thank you so much for sending your son Jesus to show us your great love. Thank you so much that he grew up with friends and family just like us. Thank you that he shows us how to obey our parents. And thank you for doing miracles on earth. We love you. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you so much for spending time with us today. And I look forward to seeing you again next time. Bye for now. J-E-S-U-S means that God's the best. Yes, he shows. Jesus, God is love. God is love. J-E-S-U-S means that God's the best. Yes, he shows us God is love. God is love. Jesus came for everyone. Amazing grace, God sent his son. Well, hallelujah. He healed the sick. He fed the poor. Show.
God sent His Son well. Got it. 